Welcome to the Windows and Computer Channel, and this is an update to the rollout of Windows 10 version 2004, or the May 2020 update. Also, we'll be separating fact from fiction, because there's a lot of people saying, well, you know, it's super buggy, don't take this, and blah, blah, blah. When in reality, it's not really buggy, because those that have some issue with it don't see it. So you won't have an update if it's not ready for your PC. And the majority of people that have gone through Windows Update have a good experience with this version update. Now, a lot of people are a little, um, you know, uh, going a little crazy because they're saying, well, why is uh, are they issuing this Windows version when they know that there are some known issues? Well, it's very simple. The known issues don't really bother the rollout for a very simple reason, it um, doesn't roll out if you are one of those with some of the problems that they know about. So you don't see it. Um, I still see a lot of people saying, well, I'm not going to get it because, you know, uh, or not installing it because of all the problems I see. Yeah, the problems you see are for are, are, are not on your PC if Windows Update shows you that you got a Windows 10 version 2004 available. Now, today they're rolling it out a little faster. Uh, starting today, June 9th, 2020, they are starting to now push it a little further. If you are on the May or November 2019 update, version 1903-1909, so they did give a new uh, status page saying that if you check for updates or manually seek via Windows updates, you might actually seek this on your machine where you didn't before because they've opened up a little more so it's going a little faster to update but they're still taking their time to measure and look at the telemetry look at the rollout and see how everything is going so some of you that didn't see it since it uh, actually was released might be seeing it starting today so you could go and check your windows update see if it's there and um, you might actually have it available. So a little, a little more people are getting it. Um, according to Microsoft, the rollout's going well. So it gives you an idea that according to their telemetry and according to what I see in the blog post, because when there's huge problems in a operating system rollout, we see a flood of people complaining and we don't see that flood. We see a background noise, which is a certain number of people having a little bit of problems here and there. But overall, the rollout is going well. And like I said, the known issues are not going to uh, give you Windows 10 2004 if you have one of them. So that's, you know, not a problem. Uh, and so some of you might be blocked because something is not there. Some of you might be blocked because of something you have on your PC that's not compatible. Uh, some of you might just not see it yet because it's not being shown to everyone all the time. One question I had several times from uh, viewers is, yeah, but I don't have a message that says that my machine's not compatible. And I don't have a, um, and I don't see it when I click Windows updates. Um, should I be worried? No, you should not. It simply will appear at some point, and it's the fact that they're rolling slowly. So a lot of PCs that might be actually compatible and okay with it are not necessarily seeing it right away. So, like I say, don't force anything. Don't you know go crazy? It's it's not there. It'll be there at some point. I will share once again this page where they update regularly. They've had an update today, June 9th. So one of them is that if you had a always on, always connected device, uh, they've actually had an update that mitigated this today, which was uh, pushed at the same time as the Windows patch uh, Tuesday security updates. So uh, that's added June 9th for the rest is the same thing right now that they are investigating for the rest of the problems and like I say if you've got any of those issues it's not showing up on your PC so you don't have to worry 
If it's showing on Windows Update for you, it's because your computer is a known computer. The software is that it's installed is known to be compatible and okay with your computer. So they're rolling out a little faster. So if, if some of you didn't see it yet, maybe you could check Windows Update if you want it right now. Once again, like I say, no rush. You'll have it in time and you'll have it someday. So don't, uh, it doesn't matter if it's, you know, not there yet. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.